I'm right. 266,000 jobs were created in November, 154,000 in the private sector, 12,000 in the government sector. The unemployment rate ticked down again to 3.5 percent. Now, the revisions in the right direction going up in September, 13,000 jobs. In October, going up, 28,000 jobs. That's an addition of 41,000 jobs for the net revisions. Uh, the U6 uh, ticked down 0.1 percent to 6.9 percent. Long term unemployment is 20.8 percent. Now, the average hourly wages ticked up 0.2 percent month over month. That's up 3.1 percent over the past 12 months, up seven cents there. Labor force participation rate little changed uh, at 63.2 percent. Uh, average hourly work week unchanged at 34.4 percent. Non supervisory wages rose seven cents. A white unemployment rate 3.2 percent. Black unemployment rate 5.5 percent. His Hispanic unemployment rate 4.2 percent, and Asian unemployment rate 2.6 percent. Now, in some of the sectors, healthcare added 45,000 jobs. That sector has added 414,000 jobs over the past 12 months. Manufacturing up 54,000 jobs, but 41,000 jobs of those is related to the strike. Uh, that's in uh, motor vehicles and parts coming back. Mining lost 7,000 jobs, down 19,000 jobs since the peak in May. Retail up 2,000 jobs, and leisure and hospitality added 45,000 jobs. That's 219,000 jobs in that sector alone over the past four months. So the bottom line, the economy created uh, 266,000 jobs, and the unemployment rate ticked down to 3.5%. Uh, it's a blowout.